Hi guys, I'm back with another video today. Today's video is going to be predictions for WWE Backlash 2023. You guys know how my predictions go by now, so let's just get right into it. So, the first match of the night is a six-man tag team match. Matt Riddle, Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn versus The Bloodline. I pick The Bloodline to win because the simple fact that they haven't won a match in a while, and this is a big match for them. It is a big match for them because um, Roman Reigns is not going to be very happy if they lose. But I think Solo Sokola is going to get them the win. So I picked the Bloodline win. Second match in the night is a singles match. Cody Rhodes versus Brock Lesnar. Um, I picked Cody Rhodes to win. The simple fact is I believe Cody Rhodes is going to be Brock Lesnar. Um, he needs to bounce back from losing to Roman Reigns, and him beating Brock Lesnar would be a great, a great start. Now, I have no idea if he's going to become the new world heavyweight champion. Um, there's a lot of rumors that it's going to be Seth Rollins, but he's a good choice. But, uh... But, uh... But, uh, but, uh, I got Cody Rhodes to win this match. Uh, third thing, singles match for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Rhea, Rhea Ripley, the champion, versus Lena Vega. Um, I got Rhea Ripley to win. The simple fact is that she's the champion, and I typically go with the safe choice, and I'm going to pick the champion. Uh, so I think Rhea Ripley is going to win this match and she's going to give the, the SmackDown Women's Championship to Bianca Belair when she wins. Fourth thing, singles match, Seth Rollins versus Omos. I believe Seth Rollins is going to win. Um, this match is very weird because there wasn't really any build up to it. They only started building up this match two weeks two weeks to the pay-per-view i feel this match is a vince mcmahon match and i'm not really happy with this match uh i think this match is probably gonna go okay i mean seth rollins is gonna try to make the match as good as it could be but I think it's going to be one of those matches that I think are just okay on the card. Uh, fifth thing, triple threat match for the United States Championship. Austin Theory, the champion, versus Bobby Lashley versus Bronson Reed. Um, my picks is Austin Theory to stay champion. Um, that's one of my safe picks. And I picked Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley is a good choice to win the United States Championship. Um, he's moving over to SmackDown with Austin Theory. Um, so even if he doesn't win the match, I figure that they're probably going to continue this feud between Bobby Lashley and Austin Theory on Friday Night SmackDown to make it just a one-on-one -on -one situation because Bronson Reed is in it. Bronson Reed, he got drafted to Raw, so if he doesn't win the championship tonight, he's just going to go to Monday Night Raw and fight for the Intercontinental Championship. But those are the two I got. Uh, sixth thing, singles match for the Raw Women's Championship. Bianca Belair, the champion versus Io Sky. I got Bianca Belair to win. I think Bianca Belair is going to win. Bianca Belair is going to win because she's the safe pick and she's also the champion. But also for the simple fact that I think they want Bianca Belair to win this match to become the longest reigning um, women's champion in the modern era of wrestling. So that's what they're going to do. And also she's going to hand over... The, the Raw Women's Championship to Rhea Ripley when she wins this match. So they're 
if Rhea Ripley and Bianca Belair both win, they will both switch over the titles. So Rhea Ripley will become Raw Women's Champion and Bianca Belair will become SmackDown Women's Champion and we'll just go from there. Seventh match in the night is a San Juan Street Fight match. Bad Bunny versus Damian Priest. Uh, I had a lot of trouble picking this match, but I came down to my final decision after a lot of thought. I picked Bad Bunny to win this match for the simple fact that I know that the Judgment Day are going to get involved in this match, but um, I think the Latino World Order will come to the side of Bad Bunny and um, the, the brawl between the Judgment Day and... Um, uh, Latino World Order will happen and uh, Brad Bunny and Damian Priest will just have their matches normal so I pick Bad Bunny to win I'm not saying there's not a chance that Damian Priest can't win I mean I think he can win but I think Bad Bunny is probably going to win this match because um, this whole this whole pay-per-view takes place in Puerto Rico and he's a big star there because he's a Latin, a Latino singer, and um, he's also a Latino wrestler. So, uh, yeah, I think the only match that I might get wrong is the six-man tag team match or the San Juan Street Fight match. But I think my predictions are pretty good. And those are my predictions for um, WWE Backlash 2023. And if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace, period.